Oh, that's a good one. It's either a really big one or a double. Hey guys. All right, so spot number two for today. Um, moved from the Tar River to the Noose, and we're in a new spot called Core Creek Landing. It's a little private um, campground. It's five bucks to launch here. It's really pretty. Uh, pretty, um, well, it's not that many boats. There's maybe four other trailers right now. And look at this. Look at all these beautiful cypress knees. Really nice kind of uh, brown, but very clear water. And we're gonna be fishing, uh, I guess around the cypress knees for crappie and uh, shad. So I'm just gonna kind of work my way out of the creek here and into the main channel and uh, over to where we were fishing um, the other day. But anyway, I'm gonna finish getting set up and then we'll launch. All right, finally getting some hits. Here we go. All right. One down.
I've been doing catching a lot on chartreuse spoons and uh, green chartreuse jig heads with um, like white and chartreuse, like a lemon lime. That's a freaking hard. It's a little one. Good job. a really big one or a double.
Now we got a striper. Nice. Nice. Like that. Shad booty finally. while you can kind of tell the size well you know what maybe I was wrong you just swimming with me that's a better one than I thought <laughs> all right I think that's 10 Oop. No, I have not, but that's the end of it for me. It's either nine or 10. I don't really want to take a chance of keeping extras. Okay guys, that about does it for today. Um, I had a pretty good day once we found the fish. <laughs> Took a little while to get to the spot, but uh, they were fast and furious for a while. Um, colors today that were hot, chartreuse, chartreuse and white grubs, uh, green jig head. Used a little bit bigger jig head, a quarter ounce, uh, just to get it down a little bit faster because we were fishing in deeper water, 13 to 16 feet, and that seemed to work pretty well. Uh, slow steady retrieve, and then sometimes with a little bit of jerk seemed to work, and uh, ended up with a little bonus striper in there. So we'll be back i'm going to bring some different rods and baits next time to see if i can get some stripers or catfish out of this spot it's pretty neat so um anyway i hope you guys enjoyed it and see you next time